Hello friends, it's Little Miss Coupons and it's CVS Sunday. I'm super excited to be here. I know we started our two week ad, but I'm actually like really excited about it. Um, I wasn't sure how I was gonna feel, but after kind of scanning through like what coupons we got this morning, and what coupons we got in our inserts and all of that. There are a lot of really, really good deals that we can grab today, even though they're like essentially the same deals as last week. Um, so I am not mad. I think if CVS is going to correspond digital coupons with like the coupons that we get each week um, and kind of like update the deals a little bit, then we're gonna be totally fine. Like it won't even really be like anything changed. And when I think about it too, like Walgreens, they keep some deals for like the whole month and you know, we're okay with that. So I think it's gonna be great. Um, I have some really good ideas for today. I am a little upset though, because my two newer accounts, they went into the vicious loop finally. And I had the one for probably like, I don't know, maybe three or four months. And the other one I only had for like maybe two months. So I'm kind of shocked that that one already did that. So, but I still have my CRTs from last week. So we should be able to still work out some really good stuff. Um, and I don't know, I'm just going to like see what happens next week, see if it's the same ones again. Um, and if so, I already asked my stepdad if I could use his number um, so I can make another new account because to me it's worth it to get those really good CRTs for like up to four months. Like that's a lot of time for you to get stuff. It does take a few weeks for you to get the CRTs, but as long as you work it out well, it's worth it. Anyways, um, I realized also that I haven't been linking my beginner and glitches explain CVS videos in my CVS hauls every week. So that will be linked down in my description box today for sure. Um, and I also, um, on my last video, I did create a printable list. So I will be creating a Google Doc and I learned how to make it public, you guys. So um, that is gonna be linked in my description box below for you guys today too. So you can just print it out, go to the store and you don't have to do that much work. I did the work for you. Um, so I also wanted to give out a huge thanks to Saving with Shay because she shouted out my channel. And anytime somebody does that, I'm super, super grateful. I was like thinking about how anyone who had just started their YouTube, like when I have a significant amount of subscribers, I think every video I will just shout somebody new out just to help them out because why not? It takes a few seconds and I love helping other people. So that is definitely going to be a staple of mine once I get over like 10,000 subscribers. If that happens, um, I am definitely gonna do that. But this intro is already three minutes long. So if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. It's totally free. Please, please, please. I'm trying to reach 5,000 subscribers so I can give away another gift card. Um, make sure your notification bell is turned on so you're notified when I post. Please smash the like button. It really helps me out and it takes one little second. Leave me a comment down below letting me know if you're new and where you're from and all of that good stuff. If you plan on going to CVS this week, blah, blah, blah. And thank you so, so much for choosing to watch you guys. Let's just get in there and grab some of these deals. All right, friends, I bought a chocolate on each one of my accounts. I did end up getting three 10 off of 70s and then a 10% off of full price purchase and a 20% off of full price purchase. I'm not sure how many accounts I'm gonna work on today because I don't have that much time. So let's just jump right into it. So I was just walking to look for something else and I found these Old Spices on clearance for $3.14. They're also buy one, get one 40% off. Um, I am gonna double check that they ring up that way when I go up to the register. So that's why I picked up four because it's three fourteen, and then the second one is a dollar eighty nine. So I might as well pick up four. We have a five dollar off three digital coupon. We would pay five oh six for all four of these, making them less than a dollar each. All right, friends, I found another clearance item for three seventy nine, and we have a two dollar digital, making this just a dollar seventy nine. I was hoping that we might have an I bought a rebate, but we don't. But I'm still gonna pick it up because I think that's a great deal. And another deal that I'm definitely picking up today because my Ibotta finally has the rebate for it is the Pediacare. I'm going to grab one of these for $8.29. I do have a $2 printable coupon I'll pull out and show you in a second. And I have a $6 Ibotta rebate. It's going to make this just $0.29. Cents. Here's that coupon for reference and you can get it right from their website and you can print like as many as you want. 
All right, friends, so I am working on the 10 off of 70, um, and obviously a lot of the things I already grabbed, well, all the things I grabbed is not giving me any extra bucks back. So the first thing I'm gonna work on is, for extra bucks back is um, the spend 30, get 10 um, transaction. One second. So I'm gonna pick up two of these Flintstone vitamins in the boxes, the ones that are $15.49. I think I'm just gonna go with two of these orange ones. So they are $15.49, like seven and some change. I know the two of them come to $23.23. I'm gonna use two of these $2 paper coupons that we just got in our inserts today and that'll take $4 off. So it'll be down to $19.23. And then you're gonna submit to Ibotta for $4 back, $2 back on each one. So bring us down to $15.23 for two, but we are not done with this deal yet because we're not quite at $30, so it's going to get better. So what I wanted to do was throw in one of these downy scent beads for $6.99. Then we would have been at $30.22 and we would have got another $1.50 back from Ibotta, but there unfortunately are none in the store, which totally stinks. So I'm gonna try to pick something else. All right, I'm just gonna throw in the downy sheets for $6.99. Um, I have no digital coupon for this and there's nothing back in Ibotta, but all three of these are gonna come to $30.22. We're just gonna get our $4 off in paper coupons. So we'll be down to pay $26.22, getting a $10 extra book back. Our CVS cost would be $16.22, but then we're gonna get $4 back on Ibotta. So it makes our cost $12.22 or about $4 each, which is great for these because they're originally $15.49 regular price. So I'm still going to pick this up. Okay, the next deal I'm going to throw in is two of these Lysol Tyler Bowl Cleaners. Um, today, for this transaction, like, I'm not really focusing on making it as cheap as possible. I decided since I'm grabbing a bunch of clearance stuff, I'm just going to grab things that I need because it would be stuff that I'm going to pay for anyways. Um, and then the rest of my transactions, I'll focus on, you know, trying to make things as cheap as possible. Um... But so I need toy bowl cleaner. So I'm doing this deal. They're $4.29, buy one, get one fifty. So it's gonna be $4.29 and $2.14, which equals $6.43. We have a 50 cent digital and a 75 cent digital off of one. Each of them are off of one. That'll bring you down to pay $5.18 at the register. You're gonna get two dollars back in extra bucks, making it a cost of $3.18 or just a dollar fifty-nine each, which I think is a great price for toy bowl cleaner. All right, friends, the last thing I'm gonna throw into this 10 off 70 is two of the Colgate Total toothpaste at $5.29. Scan this blue one the digital coupon did not attach but this gray one does so it's 10.58 right well we have a four dollar off to digital that's going to attach to the first one let me use this two dollar off to uh paper coupon that'll attach to the second one so we'll get six dollars off so we're going to pay 4.58 and get four dollars back in extra bucks for spending 10 so our cost is going to be just 58 cents for the two okay so here's my first transaction you guys everything here totals me up to 69.37 which is the 98 percent rule for our 10 off of 70 to come off so our 10 off 70 will come off and be down to 59.37 after all of our coupons and crts and stuff we will be down to pay 39.12 we're only going to get 16 back in extra bucks 10 for our spend 30 transaction two for the lysol and then four for the colgate but then we're gonna submit to Ibotta. We'll get $6 back for the Pediacare and then $4 back for the Flintstones. So we'll end up getting $26 back in total, making this transaction a cost of just $13.17, which is totally fine with me because I need these things. Well, some of these things. <laughs> So before I switch to a second card, I'm gonna do this deal again. These are buy two, get $8 back in extra bucks, and we have an, a $6 I bought a rebate here and a $4 I bought a rebate here. So I'm gonna pick up one here and one here. That's gonna come to $31.98. You could grab this one if you wanted, but it's a little more expensive. Um, all I have is a six off of 30 Schick CRT. So we'll be down to $25.98 at the register. We're going to get $8 back in extra bucks. So that'll bring us down to $17.98. Then we're going to get $10 back in Ibotta. That brings us down to $7.98. That makes these just $3.99 each, which I think is an amazing price. And that gives me two more Ibotta rebates towards my bonus. All right, friends, I found more clearance that I'm super excited to pick up. I'm working on my next account on my next 10 off of 70, and I'm going to start by picking up two of these degree spray deodorants. They are 
$3.79 on clearance. And they are buy one, get one 50% off. So I'm picking up two. They're going to be $3.79 and $1.89. That equals $5.68. We have a $2 off two digital coupon. That'll bring us down to pay $3.68 at the register. No extra bucks back because it's clearance. But I have a dollar fifty or I have fifteen hundred points on fetch, which is a dollar fifty if you pick up two at CVS. So that'll make our cost two eighteen for both or just a dollar oh nine each. So I'm definitely grabbing these for this ten off of seventy transaction. I'm gonna throw in the icy hot three seventy nine, two dollar digital makes it a dollar seventy nine. All right, next deal I'm going to throw in is two more of the Burt's Bees masks. One of these, I think, is like $4.29, and the other one is $3.19. I believe they come to $7.78. I have that $2 digital off of two. We bring it down to $5.78. Then we're going to get $4 back for buying two, so we'll make the two of them just $1.78. Okay, friends, so next thing I'm going to pick up is three of these little Eucerin Intense Repair Um lotions for $6.59. The three of them come to $19.77. They're spent $20, get a $10 extra buck, and $19.60 is the 98% rule of $20. So we are good. So I'm going to grab the three of these for $19.77. I have a $3 digital coupon off of one. And then I'm going to use these other two $3 paper coupons on the other ones. So it'll take $9 off. So we'll be down to $10.77. But I also have a 3 off of 12 lotion CRT. So we're going to pay $7.77 and get a $10 extra buck back. So the three of these should be a $2.33 money maker. Since I'm using that 3 off 12 CRT with my 10 off of 70, I'm going to have to get up to $82 to be able to have both of them come off. Okay, friends, so I'm going to do a Colgate Optical yeah, deal in this 10 off of 70. Um, we have a $5 digital for these. I'm going to pick up one of these for $11.29. These are spend, the Colgate Optic White is spend 25, get a $10 extra buck. So then I'm going to grab three of these at $4.69. So all four of these come to $25.36. We have a $5 digital coming off here. We have a $4 off two digital coming off here. I'm going to use this $2 paper coupon off two for the last one. So then we're going to be down to $14.36, getting a $10 extra buck back. Our cost is only $4.36 for all four. Next thing I'm going to throw in is two boxes of Reese Puffs. They are $1.99 each, so the two of them are $3.98. We have a dollar off two digital coupon, bring it down to $2.98. And then I'm going to submit to Ibotta for a dollar back on two brings it down to a dollar 98 for two and this is going to track towards my um next fetch bonus i'm going to throw in another pedia care on this transaction with this two dollar coupon because my other ibotta has a six dollar rebate for this so it's going to be like almost a freebie for just 29 cents all right, friends, last thing I'm throwing in on this account are two of the poise. They are two for $13. We have a $5 off two digital coupon. That's going to bring them down to two for $8. Then we're going to need a $2 extra book back, brings them down to two for six or $3 each. So I'm going to throw them into this transaction. All right, friends, so my next transaction is the four Colgate, the two birth bees, the icy hot, the two degree, the pedia care, the three Eucerin, the two cereal and the poise so all of that comes to 87.65 my 10 off 70 will come off and my 3 off 12 will come off with my total being that high after all of our coupons we should be down to pay 38.65 we'll get 26 dollars back in extra bucks that's 10 for the colgate 10 for userin 2 for poise and 4 for the birth bees then we're going to submit to Ibotta for $6 back on the Pediacare, a dollar back on the cereal. That will also track, but I won't get any points on fetch. Then I'll get $1.50 back on fetch for the degree. That'll make all of this stuff right here a cost of just $4.15. Okay, friends, I'm working on my next account. Um, I'm kind of flying today, which is great. But um, my stepdad is always asking for multivitamins. And we have this really great deal that hopefully will work. I'm going to test it out and see. Um, for the one-a-day gummies, they're like the 170-count gummies, right? So they're $21.99, buy one, get one fifty, And they are part of the spend 30, you get a $10 extra buck. So what I'm going to do is pick up two of these, okay? This is be $21.99 and $10.99, so that equals $32.98. We have an $8 digital coupon, but we also, off two, we also have an $8 paper coupon that we just got today in our inserts off of two. So hopefully they should glitch. Um, and that should bring us down to pay $16.98, getting a $10 extra buck back. 
um, would make the cost six ninety eight for both, or like three ninety nine each, right? Three. <laughs> All right, friends, I'm so excited for my boost deal. I love boosts, and I love getting deals on these. Um, and my store is not tagged, but they are buy one get one fifty percent off, and they are buy four earn ten dollars in extra bucks. So I'm going for the ones that are eleven forty nine. So I'm gonna pick up four. So I think I'm just gonna grab one vanilla. I'm definitely going to grab two chocolate because people always want the chocolate. I sell this stuff a lot, you guys. Um, and then I'm going to grab a strawberry. So I'm picking up these four, right? So they're $11.49, $5.74. dollars So that comes to $34.46. We have a $5 off two digital that will attach to the first one. And then hopefully... So we have two at 11.49 and then two at 5.74, right? So, okay, ideally, hopefully, the $6 will attach to one that is 11.49 and then the $5 should attach to the half price one. Hopefully, I don't know if it's gonna work out like this. This is just me spitting crap. Um, and then a, the other $6 one would attach to the other one for 11. I don't know. I'm just going to try it out and see if it does work out that way. I guess we'll see on the receipt. If it works out and all three of those coupons come off, we would be down to $17.46 getting a $10 extra book back. Cost is $7.46 or $1.86 each, you guys. So with this stuff, I'm literally at $67.44. I need something so little just to get me over. Um, so I'm going to go back and probably just grab something on clearance or just, I don't know. Let me go check. I'm just going to throw in the Colgate deal again. Remember they're $5.29 each, two for $10.58. We'll get the $4 off two digital and then a $2 off two paper coupon. So we'll pay $4.58, get a $4 extra buck for spending 10. Um, so our cost will be just 58 cents for these. So that'll definitely put me over the $70 mark to use my 10 off 70 here. All right, so here is this transaction, you guys. Everything is $78.02. Our 10 off 70 will come off. We'll be down to $68.02. Then we would get $16 off for the one a day, 17 off for the boost, six off for the Colgate. So we've got to be down to pay $29.02. We're gonna get $24 in extra bucks back, 10 for boost, 10 for one a day, and four for Colgate. That would make it a cost of $502. But all right, friends, I again I'm trying to reach my Ibotta bonus, the big one this time, because I already hit my weekend warrior. Um, so I'm gonna do an Ollie deal. I think this is a really good deal, and this will be good for people who like this brand. Um, I'm gonna pick up one of these for $10.49, and then I'm gonna pick up one of these for $19.99. So our total for the two is $30.48. We have no digital coupons for these, so you would pay that at the register, right? You'll get your $10 extra buck back for spending $30, so you'd bring it down to $20.48. But then you're going to get $4 back and I bought it for this one. You'll get $2 back and I bought it for this, plus you'll get a dollar bonus for redeeming, sorry, two offers. So you're going to get four, five, six, seven. So your cost will be $13.48 for the two or like seven bucks each which is a pretty good deal um bringing this all the way down from 19.99 and even just a little bit of savings here cost is 6.74 each to be exact so i'm throwing these into my last 10 off of 70 along with these i'm gonna throw in the colgate deal again and four more boost and then i only have one more account that i want to do a couple things on and i will be done all right you guys i did not have the colgate digitals so i added the boost but I'm going to try to do the Garnier deal. I know this hasn't been working, but I'm going to test it out and see if it is. Um, they're two for eight. Buy two, get a $3 extra bucks. We have a $3 digital in a $3 printable. So that should take $6 off. So we should pay $2 and get a $3 extra buck back, making them a dollar moneymaker. Um, but we're going to have to see if it works. So I don't know. We'll just test it out. I had to grab the whole blends because my computer did not print me the Fruitiques paper coupon. So all of this is $72.94. We'll get our 10 off 70 and then we're going to get $17 off for the Boost and 6 off for the whole blends. Nothing off for the Ollie. We'll pay $39.94 at the register. We're going to get $23 back in extra bucks plus $7 on Ibotta. That makes this a cost of $9.94 for everything. All right, friends, I'm on my last account. I'm just doing two really quick things. I know these are buy one, get one 50, but... Um, we don't have a second one, so I'm picking this up for $18.49. Oh my god, I can't even. I have two cards and I'm struggling. Um, I'm gonna add a Tide for $13.49 to this. 
So it'll be right around $30. I have a $7 coupon for this and a $3 for the Tide, hopefully. That'll take $10 off. I think we'll be down to like $21.48, I want to say it is. We'll get $10 or $20.48. Then we'll get $10 back in extra bucks. So it'll be down to $10.48 for the two, which would make them $5 each. But on my points, we have 1,190 points, which is like $7.14 back. Like I said, it worked last week, so I'm going to try to do it again. It would make my cost like $1.50 each. I'm grabbing these Tide Pods for $13.49, and then this one is $18.49. Okay, so this is my Spend 30, Get 10. The two of them is $31.98. We have $10 coming off, so we'll pay $21.98. We'll get $10 back in extra bucks, so our cost for CVS will be $11.98 after our extra bucks back. Um, but my points has 1,190 points back for the Aleve, and like I said, it worked last week, and it's back in, so I'm going to try it again. That should be like $7.14 coming back. Would make my cost just four eighty for the two of these so i'm definitely grabbing them the last thing i'm grabbing on this account is two of the lucky charms they're $1.99 so two of them is going to be $3.98 i have two dollar off two um cereal coupons so those will glitch and come off so that's gonna take two dollars off we don't do $1.98 then i'm going to submit to my other i bought it for a dollar back on two that'll make our cost 98 cents but then i these are the last two i need for my fetch rebate so i'm going to get an additional dollar back there so they're going to be free all right, friends, I am back home with this epic CVS haul, and I could not be more happy with how it turned out. I got a lot of stuff today. Um, my haul definitely had a cost, but I am totally okay with that. I had some extra money because I sold a lot of couponing stuff today. Um, so I wasn't upset with just going out, couponing for fun, and not worrying about trying to make it as absolutely cheap as possible. It was nice to do that for once. Um, I mean, I love obviously having hauls that are free and a moneymaker, and I absolutely try to do that all the time, but it's just nice once in a while to just kind of get the deals that you really want to get and not worry about how cheap it's going to actually end up being, um, but money was saved regardless, a lot of it. So... Um, everything on the table turned out to be a cost of $42.53, which again, I am totally okay with that. I saved $353.92 at CVS today. I have 52 items and they worked out to be 81 cents an item, which for anything on the table is an absolutely fantastic price. Um, so yeah, let's just go over my receipts and we will call it a day. All right, friends, here's my first receipt. We have the Downy um, dryer sheets at $6.99. I do want to let you guys know that the $1.50 Downy scent bead rebate picked that one up and gave me the $1.50 back for that. Then I have the four Old Spice deodorants, buy one. Who well, those didn't ring up, buy one, get one fifty. Um, but they were all on clearance. Huh. All right, that's okay. Um, we have the Icy Hot that was on clearance. Then the two Lysol, buy one, get one fifty. The two Flintstones, buy one, get one fifty, and then the two Colgate Totals, and the Pediacare. So, I had a four $2 um, paper coupons, and there were two of them for the Flintstone gummies, a $2 for the Colgate, and... Oh, a $2 for the Pediacare. My 50 cent and 75 cent for the Lysol came off. $5 for Old Spice. $4 glitch for the Colgate. Um, $2 for Icy Hot. My 10 off 70. I used 21 in extra bucks. Paid a subtotal of 20.62. So that means we spent out 41.62. I only got back 16 in extra bucks. That was two for Lysol, four for Colgate, and 10 for spending 30 on the Flintstones and Downey. So... We got back 16 extra bucks. I got back 11.50 on Ibotta. That means we got back 27.50. Made this transaction a cost of $14.12. So then, I'm sorry, you guys. My nose is kind of stuffy. I did my next transaction with the two poise, two for 13, the two Reese puffs, the two degree deodorants, the icy hot. Um, one Burt's Bees mask, then those three Colgates at four sixty nine, three Eucerins at six fifty nine, the other Burt's Bees mask, and then the Optic White at eleven twenty nine, and the Pediacare. So, I had two three dollar paper coupons 
for the Eucerin. Those worked. And then a $2 for the Pediacare and a $2 for the Colgate. My $5 for the Poise came off. $4 Colgate glitched. My other $3 Eucerin came off. $2 Burt's Bees. $2 Icy Hot. $2 Degree. And $1 General Mills. My 10 off 70 and my 3 off 12 hand and body lotion came off. I used 1901 in Extra Bucks. And I just threw that 20% on for $0.94 cents off. My subtotal was 2760 plus 1901. We spent out 4661. I did end up getting back 26 in extra bucks, but it only printed me my $2 extra buck for the poise and then my $10 extra buck for the user and aquaphor. She had to force print me the $4 extra buck for the birds bees and the $10 extra buck for um the Colgate uh Optic white. I'm not sure why they didn't print, but she did give them to me. Then I got back seven dollars on Ibotta, a dollar fifty on Fetch, so we got back thirty four fifty, making this receipt a cost of twelve dollars and eleven cents. Then I moved on to this receipt. So I grabbed those two shicks. I had the six off thirty. I used ten dollars in extra bucks. I threw two twenty percent offs on there, so I ended up paying out twelve forty seven. Plus my ten dollars in extra bucks, so we spent out twenty two forty seven. Got back eight and extra bucks for buying two, and then ten dollars on Ibotta. Made our cost four forty seven. Next transaction. So we have the two one a days, buy one get one fifty, the four boosts, and then the two Colgates. So I use an eight dollar paper coupon for the one a day, a two dollar coupon for the Colgate, and two six dollar paper coupons for the boost. We have our glitch with the Colgate, glitch with our one a day, and glitch with the boost five dollar. I used the ten off seventy. I only had one penny in extra bucks. I threw a 20% off and a 10% off on here just because I wasn't gonna use them anywhere else. My subtotal was 29.11. So if you add that plus the one cent, we spent out twenty nine twelve. We got back twenty four in extra bucks. That was four dollars for Colgate, ten dollars for Boost, and ten dollars for spending thirty. Um, for the one days, I did not get the extra money back on my points. It rejected it. Totally fine. Just wanted to test it out. Like I said, not sure why it worked last week, but whatever. Uh, cost was five twelve. Then I did this transaction with the two um, Whole Blends Garnier. The four boosts and the two Ollie vitamins. All I had were the two $6 paper coupon for the boost. It glitched with the digital. Then I had a $3 digital for the Garnier. My $3 printable did not scan. 10 off 70. I used $9.69 in extra bucks. We paid out a sum total of $34.15. I was really low on extra bucks this week, you guys. So I was paying a lot of out of pocket. But I spent out $43.84. We got back seven on Ibotta and $22 in uh, extra bucks. So I got back 10 for purchasing four boost, two for the whole blends, and then 10 for the spend 30, which means we got 29 back, making this receipt a cost of $14.84. And then on my last receipt, we did the two Lucky Charms, the Tide Pod, and the Aleve X. So we have the $1 digital that glitched with the $1 digital for the Lucky Charms, my $3 digital for the Tide Pods, 7 for the Aleve. I used $16.01 in extra bucks, and I threw on all my percent off so they wouldn't go to waste. My subtotal was $5.71. That's what I paid out. So if you add that plus $16.01, we paid out $21.72. I got back $1.85 on Fetch, $1 on Ibotta. And then on my points, I did get the $7 back for the Aleve. And then we got back $10 in extra bucks for spending 30. So that made this receipt a cost of just $1.87. So friends, if you add up all my totals, you actually get $52.53, but I did get my $10 um, big bonus on Ibotta back. So it made my cost $42.43 for everything on the table, or $42.53 for everything on the table. Again, I saved $353.92 and I have 52 items, which works out to be 81 cents an item. I'm super happy with that. I hope you guys can get some great deals this week. Maybe you can get it cheaper than I did. Maybe you guys have a moneymaker haul. That's amazing. I hope so. That's not how it was for me this week and that's totally fine. You are not always going to have a moneymaker haul, but I will tell you saving over $300 is amazing to me. So I'm totally fine with paying $42.53 for, Jesus, like $500 worth of product. You know what I mean? So again, I'm super happy. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this today. I was excited to go back to CVS this week and see how week two of being on the same ad would go. And I think it went great. I am not upset about this. I think we all are going to be fine. I think it's going to be a great thing. It might even be easier for some of us because the deals don't change for two weeks. So it's not so much to have to keep up on. But 
If you guys are not subscribed, please subscribe. It's totally free. Smash the like button. It really helps me out. Leave me a comment down below letting me know if you're new, where you're from, and all that good stuff. Make sure your notification bell is turned on so you're notified when I post. And thank you so, so much for watching my video today. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!